So today we've got a 6th generation iPad, and this is off the beaten path of my usual iPad videos because this one is not completely destroyed. Not as interesting a repair, but probably more applicable to the everyday user I think. Basically, we just need to replace the digitizer. So I'll demonstrate the fault with the Apple Pencil. We have a band across the screen that is not registering anything. As per usual, I tackle tablets one side at a time. I heat with my hot air station, then use suction and pry tools to gain access. With a slight gap from my thin metal tool, I can slip in the plastic ones. You don't necessarily need the metal one, I've just found it to be easier over time. And I've cracked the digitizer. If this is you, then don't get discouraged because it still happens to me. Any small defect in the glass can make this happen, or it's really easy to do if you're removing some eBay knockoff digitizer. Luckily, we're changing this part anyway. So let's continue the same thing on the other side. and now I can move up to the top. It usually has more adhesive in the side, so heat more is necessary and work slower. Then on to the bottom. Just be careful of the ribbon cables on the bottom right, especially the ribbon for the home button that contains our touch ID. Now the digitizer lifts to the side and that'll expose the four screws holding down the display panel. The display lifts downwards, then prop it to remove the three screws holding down the connections. Then disconnect the four connections to remove the display and digitizer. Now I'm going to extract the home button and the ribbon. This is so we can keep our Touch ID functionality. And there it is. And that's probably the cause of our issue. It's a small tear, but it caused that much of a dead zone. Now to place our home button into the new digitizer. With that placed in and clicky, we can assemble it for testing. I always encourage testing before sealing anything up, no matter how confident you might be. With that looking good, now onto my biggest pain in the butt, making sure we are clear of any dust and smudges. Go ahead and clamp it close for a while to adhere. And 
and that was a replacement of a digitizer on an iPad 6 generation. Much less dramatic than most of my other videos, but I do hope you found the video interesting and helpful. My last two cents is, if you're replacing the home button, then don't get too excited with the RF shielding present. Uh, absolutely nothing is underneath it. Anyway, I'd more than appreciate your subscription and hope you'll join me on the next one.